Hey guys, uh, I'm Ethan Moore from Stockman Supply. Um, on a previous video I did, I was sanding a great big burl slab with the Flatmaster sander. And I, I got a comment on the video from JB, and he wants to know how to adjust the thickness of your cut or the depth of your cut with the Flatmaster. Um, the answer might be a little bit different than what you'd expect, but um, here it is. Um, first things first, when you're setting up the Flatmaster, you set it up to a 220 grit. You want that 220 grit just below the table. So when I pass that wood across, you might hear it scratch, but I can't roll the drum. Now that 220 grit piece of sandpaper, it has a 2,000 grain of sand, a 2,000 cutter on that paper. So here's what's gonna happen when I sand. I'm gonna remove about 2,000 of an inch. Now on a nice plain piece of wood, that's fine. So a couple passes, this will be nice and sanded. If I'm dealing with something that's a little rougher, that two thousandths of an inch isn't gonna do very much. I gotta get something a lot more aggressive. I gotta remove more material. So the way to adjust the depth of cut, to make your depth of cut deeper, it's really simple. You're gonna change the grit. So the size of the grit on an 80 grit piece of sandpaper, that's what I have on this side of the drum, is actually about 16 thousandths of an inch. So every pass I'm gonna make, I'm gonna remove 16 thousandths of an inch from the high spot. So watch what happens here. There's one pass. So if I do one more pass, maybe two, this will be totally flat. One more. All right. Now I still got some of those deeper sawmill marks here, uh, but now that I got this nice and flat, I can go to my 220 grip and I can sand it. So now I'm removing two thou from the entire piece. There's a 220 grit. So, depth of cut. 60 grit, you're gonna remove about 22 tau. Uh, a 80 grit, you're gonna remove about 16 tau. A 120 grit, about 12 tau. Um, a 180 grit, about 4 tau. A 220 grit, you're gonna remove about 2 tau. Once you get beyond the 220 grit though, uh, you remove very little. Like a 400 grit, it's about half a thousandth of an inch. Um, so. That's how you adjust the depth of cut. Simple answer is, you just change the paper. Um, so if anyone else has any other questions, just comment on this video or send me an email at info at stockhomsupply.com. And thank you guys for watching. And if you want to see future videos, please subscribe.